Welcome back. At the end of the show, we've got Phil Vickery and Fern Britain, but it's time for my next guest. Now, the West End at the moment is packed with some brilliant shows, and one of the most original is a show called War Horse. It's a very moving play about the extraordinary bond between a young boy and his horse. Everyone who's seen it has raved about it, not least because the horses are, in fact, puppets. And in a moment, I'm going to be meeting one of them. But first, take a look at this. Nice to meet you. Nice yeah, to meet you. Who do you yeah. play in the show? I play Albert. He's yeah. a young lad, a uh, young farmer from Devon, and um, and this is Joey, uh, who's who's his horse. It's incredible. Yeah. yeah. Just look, look. I mean, you train him in the show, do you? I. I oh, oh, wow. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Deirdre go. Like that. <laughs> it's uh, it's magical, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So what happens in the show with with this little horse? Well, Albert well, meets. He's a bit shy. Look, look at him. Come, Come say hello to Paul. Come on. Yeah, now Albert meets um, Joey as a foal. <laughs> Incredible. Yeah. Anyone and... sugar lumps? Uh, <laughs> have us. Well, come on, he's looking for one in my pocket. There you go. Um, yeah, Albert meets Joey as a foal and brings him up and, um, and they fall in love and then Joey gets conscripted to the First World War and uh, Albert follows him to find him. Oh, my wow. God. Mm. Do you forget, do you, do you, do you absolutely believe in them? Do you think they're real? Oh, no, yeah. no, completely. Yeah. I mean, we worked a lot with real horses to kind of, obviously, yeah. to, to get the feel of them. But then you meet these, these puppets and you kind of go... I mean, they're incredible. Yeah, Look, yeah. it's like the, the whole yeah. movement. Now, Vanessa, who puts a light dusting of powder on me when I come in, <laughs> <laughs> in makeup, she, she's that soft, she was howling. She went to see yeah. this and she, was, she said she found it really, really moving. And another friend of mine who saw this said it's a real adult fairy tale. He said it's yeah. just magical. Yeah. Uh, it, what's the responses like with the audiences? It's I'm mad. It's incredible. They um, uh, it's a real tearjerker, emotional piece, and it's got a kind of real climactic end, which I won't reveal to you. But um, yeah, no, we we get wonderful responses from the audiences and standing ovations. And it's incredible. It's, it's brilliant. It's absolutely. It's quite moving. How do you make them look so real, Rachel? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, well, there are a lot of things to think about, but um, a really important place to start is to think about the breath of the puppet, what it's breathing, how it's breathing, tells you how it's feeling. Yeah. And so the three people around the puppet have to breathe in unison with the horse. And so that's a very good place to start, and it means that if you're about to take off in a movement, you will take off together, because you all got the same breath. And um, Ears are a very important signal to how a, what a horse is paying attention to. God they don't necessarily wow. look at things, they listen to things. Yeah. And, um, and tail movements and just trying to be as one. I mean, physically, it must be really demanding to do this, is it's it? It is quite, yeah. yeah you kind getting... of, we get quite rosy cheeked and sweaty when we're running around. You get cramp around. halfway through. And think, oh, you, you can, you can. <laughs> horse is taking yeah. a rest now. Yeah, yeah. 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 Horse has gone out Look, it's just. I don't um, think you like that. Can I have a go? I'm desperate to see Gina. <laughs> you take the handle and you also take some of the weight with your hand in there and you can wiggle oh, you on can the wiggle ears. His ears as I tend well. to use a little finger under there and then I've got my fingers up there. Okay. Too. Right, so, yeah, yo, so fella. How are you doing? Hey. <laughs> I think he fancies a bit of You're turning it into a goat pool. No, no, no. <laughs> if you pull the neg out and then down to the grass, it'll reach. That's I'm it. Scared of like breaking it. No, You've got to go don't. to a show tonight and say, so <laughs> apologise because Paul O'Grady ripped the horse's head off. <laughs> 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 I haven't got the knack like you, you do it. No, lovely. you do it really gracefully. When it descends to eat the grass, it's totally believable. When I do it, it's like end of pay a puppet show. Look. <laughs> well, it takes a bit of practice. It, but... they're, and they're beautifully made. Look at them. Mm. Absolutely. Is this the only horse in the show? No, there's a there's another one, and I'll I'll get him for you. Will you? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Would you would you want to? Look? Here he comes. Whoa! Oh, God, oh, my God. Whoa! Oh my lord. 
That's incredible, isn't it? Eh? Where's the show on? Got to come see this. Yeah. Where is it? Where's the? It's where are you? I'm <laughs> around this way. Oh, I. <laughs> so, where's uh, the show on? It's at the New London Theatre, um, Drury Lane, Covent Garden. It's, <laughs> it's... Do you get on this horse? I do. Yeah. Yeah. I have to, I have to jump on it. If Go you... on then. Yeah. You want to get on, on it? Let's see. Let's have a look. Yeah. It's. Inc I can't get over that. Seriously, that's wow. just. It's a work of art, yeah. isn't it? Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, so. Whoa. Look at him. In incredible. Just incredible. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, please, let's hear it for the Castor War Horse. Come on. Come on. It's fantastic. Wow. Brilliant. I'm going. I'm going to go and see this. Yeah. Oh.